，大家好，我上面会一直有这个在移动的圈圈，我不太确定它为什么会一直出现在这里。The other way you can use it is if you want to write a poem, but you're not really sure about whether how to approach it, and you want some ideas. I know that many people would do better if they can see some examples first. I personally don't like to do that because I think when I see examples, I can only think in one way, and it limits me. But I know that a lot of people like to see examples, and if you just look at the great works, you may not necessarily find so many examples on the topic that you want. So you can tell this AI to create the haikus specifically on your topic. So then you can see something that's more similar, and then maybe make it better. Or get some inspiration from it, but the danger of this is always that you might end up copying when you don't want to. So you want to be especially careful with that. With great power, says Spider-Man, comes great responsibility. So we really have to think hard about how we use that. In any case, I hope that you have learned quite a bit about the haiku, and that you will consider picking it up yourself to read and to create, because creating. Is truly one of the most important things that you could be doing for your English learning, and I hope that you share this this idea of creating haikus with the people around you. It could be a lot of fun. Thank you so much for letting me take a little bit more time today.、Um, I guess I'm just so excited to share all of this with you that I didn't notice how quickly the time was passing by. With that, I will see you the next time, and next time should be our last anything. For the season, for the semester, rather, we've gone through two seasons together,、um, and I hope that this is something that we will continue. I'm still in the process of planning for next year, and I hope that I will continue to see many of you here. Until the next time, until next week, bye.